Hello, thank you for watching our videos. The very first concept we are going to be talking about is cueing or how to start a piece of music. Of course, because the chamber music group like this doesn't have a conductor, you guys are going to have to decide who is going to cue, who is going to make the movement to start the piece. Most often, it will be the first violin. But don't get too comfortable with this idea. Often within the piece of music, there are phrases in the score that are underlined and played by other instruments, like in the examples we are going to hear in a second. The point is, don't assume anything and always be ready. How to cue is another very important thing to talk about. You would think that it is very easy, counting one, two, three, and go. But it is nothing of the sort. Depending on the style, on the character, on the tempo, you are going to have several different types of cues. In the energetic example, we want to show a pretty fast movement of a scroll and also a fast breath, preferably within a value of the beat. In this example, you are going to hear such beginning, fast and energetic. In the second example, you have quite a different character, lyrical and calm. In opposition to the previous example, the cuer breathes slower and moves the scroll much slower. Here it is. In a fast, light character, you want to limit your movement so that it doesn't um, impose dragging in the future. Here is the example of a fairly light dance-like character. And here is a playful character. Of course, as I mentioned before, things can get pretty complicated within the piece. It is very possible that within uh, the movement or after you start the piece, you are going to have to show the beginning of a new phrase. And again, often it is not going to be necessarily the first violin. In this example, the viola is starting the movement because it so happened that the melody is in the viola part in the score. A good cue represents what the music is all about, its character and its tempo. The cue has to be clear, it has to be adequate, so your movement has to reflect the tempo and the character of the piece. 